वेलकम एवरी वन होप यू ऑल आर डूइंग वेल टूडेज लेक्चर इज गोइंग टू बी अबाउट स्पीच राइटिंग वॉट इज अ स्पीच अ स्पीच इज बेसिकली अ फॉर्मल टॉक दैट वन गिव्स टू एन ऑडियंस दिस इज द डेफिनेशन वेन यू आर एक्सप्रेसिंग योर थाट्स एंड इमोशन इन फ्रंट ऑफ द पब्लिक वेन यू आर एक्सप्रेसिंग योर सेल्फ बेसिकली द फॉर्मल टॉक इन फ्रंट ऑफ द ऑडियंस इज द स्पीच सो what is the correct method to give the speech what is the correct method to write a speech so a well structured speech is consist of three important part that is introduction body and conclusion i repeat introduction body and conclusion what is introduction you might be knowing that you are introducing yourself yes right you have to start by greeting your audience and then you will introduce yourself and then you are going to give the audience an idea about the topic on which you are going to speak for example good morning everyone my name is dr shafat and today i'm going to talk about global health so what i did i start by greeting my audience i introduced myself by saying my name you can elaborate that also and then i have given the audience an idea about the topic on which i'm going to speak basically i disclosed my topic in the in the introduction only after that the main part that is body now in body you are going to include all the key factors all the important points and all the main thing of the speech okay it the body could be about to about like you can write two paragraphs or three paragraphs depending about the time limit that they have given okay so it's up to you basically you have to cover all the important points all the key points in the body only then comes to conclusion now what you are going to write in the conclusion so basically you are going to summarize the topic in the conclusion um you have to beautifully wind up the topic in the topic you can add phrases you can add idioms you can add thoughts it could be the call to action basically aapki ending aise honi chahiye ki aap speech end bhi kar do to wo aapki audience par ek ke mind par ek everlasting effect chhod de ki wow what a wonderful wonderful speech he has given to conclusion mein aapko jo hai aise closing lines likhne hain ki wo ek beautifully ek acche mood par aakar jo hai aap usko khatam kar do basically you have to summarize the speech and add the closing lines in the conclusion so these are the three key points the important points that you have to keep in mind while writing an effective speech aap jo hai exams mein bhi aapko question puchte hai ki aapko jo hai particular topic pe jo hai speech likhni hai aap us samay bhi inhi key points ko jo hai follow kar kar speech likh sakte hain ya fir agar aap kisi stage par khad kar audience ko speech de rahe ho tab bhi aapko inhi points ko follow karna hai to deliver this uh, the effective speech so i hope you understood that how you have to write a speech you have to keep this important point in mind you have to start with introduction then you'll go to the body and then you're going to end by writing the conclusion so this is how you're going to write a speech i hope this video will be helpful for you if you're planning to write a speech i'll see you soon in the next video with a new topic till then take care